All right. So it's April third. Um, Persona Five's come out for nine o'clock for some places. Other places you'll have to wait till tomorrow. Uh, but I did manage to get the Take Your Heart Premium Edition for this game. I'm gonna go ahead and unbox it for you guys and see what's going on here. So check out the packaging; it's pretty swell. Check out the contents right there. Um, let me try and get that in little focus. Um, pretty sleek. Pretty uh, pretty good packaging. It's the same as on the standard and stuff. Um, you know, except you just conceal the contents and things of that nature. Um, so yeah, but very nice packaging. Pretty uh, pretty slick. I'm gonna go ahead and pop that on off. Oop, sorry. To no one in particular. Um, that's pretty nice. Um, got a picture of the three main heroes and their little mascot, uh, Morgana. Looks like their personas. Uh, what else we got? Hmm. Oh, snap! And then you got everyone else on the back. Uh, the rest of the crew for this. Um, loving the art. Very cool. Alright, so let's just pop this thing open. I'm excited. So actually, it's an actual box. Um, oh, look at that. Oh, man. <laughs> Alright, well, so let's start with... Ooh, okay, so it comes with a 4-inch Morgana plushie. The, like I said, the mascot character. Um, gonna try and pop this open. Take a look, see. Snap, one-handed. <laughs> Maybe. Here we go. Oops, sorry. Nailed it. All right. So, pretty cute. Uh, very SD. Very just gigantic head. Um, top of it, the mask part kind of feels like nylon. Um, rest of it's just plush. Uh, looks like the belt. Everything here. Oop. Trying to get some focus for you guys. Um, there we go. Um, it looks like the belt and everything's made out of a harder kind of felt. Uh, pretty neat though. Um, it's got the tag right down here. M might be a little hard to hang it up anywhere if that's your thing, but not bad. Um, now what I'm most excited for, <laughs> actually I wonder if I should get, I'll get to this last. Yeah, look at that, the art book. Yeah, get to it in minutes, guys. All right, so um, check out the soundtrack. Um, Two Velvet Room guards here. I'll try and get that glare off for you. Um, Sounds of Rebellion. Um, not surprised it comes in one of the uh, kind of like slip cases for most special edition kind of things do. Um, and it doesn't have the full soundtrack roster on it again. Um, like the full soundtrack for the game is like 50 plus songs. It looks like we've got 19 on here. Um, oop, there's my face. Hey! Um, Let's try and get this. There we go, that's a little better. Got Igor on the back. The list of the tracks right there. Um, oh no, my favorite one isn't on here. It's uh, like the awakening of a thief or something like that. Or villain, I can't remember, but it's really great. Um, so that's not too bad. Um, pop that open real quick and see. You know, put you guys right down here for a quick second. Um, while we open this up, sorry for that. Oh, thought I could do it one-handed. Uh, clearly can't. Ah, check out what the CD looks like. Um, okay, sorry about that. So, uh, where's where are we going? Where are we going with this? Maybe at the top, maybe the side. Never know with these things, am I right? Hey, all right, all right, it's the top. Um, eh. And uh, the case or the uh, image on the disc is just the same as it is on the case right there. So, um, again, not bad. Pretty cool to have. Um, go ahead and slip that back in the case here and put it off to the side. Um, looks like. The uh, special edition came with, or the Take Your Heart edition does come with the steel book, which you can get separately um, in limited quantities. So that's pretty cool. I actually really like the cover on this. Kind of goes with the whole like camaraderie, thievery theme, black and white noir. Digging it. And like I said, the back uh, packaging is the same as the on the special edition. Um, 
Ooh, pop that out. Take a closer look. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's pretty nice. Pretty slick. Digging it. And let's see if there's anything inside. Ooh. Let's take a look at the case right there. CD. And your instruction manual. Yeah, for disclosure. Um... I don't think it's a flip case, unfortunately. I mean, the illustrations on the inside look pretty swell. Um, but I'm actually really digging the steel case. I think it's excellent, really. Um, let's put that off to the side. Yeah, one of these sides. All right. Almost done, guys. Let's take a look at this. Uh, Note to self, buy a camera stand. Um, so, we also got the double bag for the high school, uh, for the main characters. Um, I mean, it, it's pretty much what you would expect coming from, like, a $90 special edition, which, this is all only 90 bucks, so you get, like, an art book, a plushie, this bag, the soundtrack, and the game, which, pretty good value, I'd, I'd, I'd wager. Uh, but it's nice, it's an alright bag, it feels really kind of flimsy, um, I'd be worried after about a using it for a prolonged period of time it would start to wear down. Um, let's take a look on the inside, I guess, just to see if there's anything. Like, oh, that's actually really nice. It's, uh, <laughs> it's the uh, same pattern as the main character's pants. I guess that's part of the uniform as well. Uh, but it doesn't feel too bad. I mean, it's, like I said, for 90 bucks, it is what it is. Uh, It's not a bad handbag. Like, I'd take it for an overnight bag or something like that, maybe. Um, definitely, if you're if you're into the cold cosplay scene, this probably is going to be one of your better bets. Uh, yeah, it's not a bad bag. Uh, but it is, you got to remember, it's the price point of it. it not the best, uh, but it's all right. Now, finally, what I am most excited for is this hardback art book. Um, let me pop this off real quick. Push the uh, limited edition box back a little bit. Clean this area up. Let's take a look here, shall we? Um, so I'm really, really hoping there's going to be some concept art in here. Um, not just like illustrations, which, again, when these special editions come out, usually it's just like the official artwork for characters, and you know, it's and you don't really get to see behind it. So really hoping we get something good here. Um, it's cool that it's hard back too. Shot the main character. Push that over. Um, so you got the main character right there. His persona, thief version. Ah, oh, there. It, ooh, oh, no, 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 no! Come back, come back. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. The concept art. All right. So instantly, I would say it's worth it. Um, I, I'm not a huge fan of art books that don't have a. Uh, some sort of concept art at work in it, uh, but the fact that this has it, I'm really, really pleased with that. That's fantastic. Even got some for his persona. Um, got Anne there. Some more concept. That was actually pretty fantastic. I'm, I'm really pleased with that, so just kind of give it a quick flip. You guys can pause it if you need to. <laughs> uh, I wonder if Morgana was always going to be a cat. Uh, looks like. I mean, oops, sorry. That makes sense, you know, cats, thieves, prowling, burglar, you know. Uh, I'm actually really looking forward to that mascot. A little more than Teddy, 
Uh, I'm hoping there are going to be some cat puns. Uh, cat puns or bust. Uh, <laughs> so we'll see. Uh, very nice. Some of the other characters that I'm assuming come into the game. Don't know who they are. Kind of want to flip through it. Um, more social links. I uh, got old Igor. The twins. the Car uh, Caroline and Justine. There we go. Uh, some more concepts of some of the characters you'll meet. I'm sure there'll be social links in there. Got some artwork of the school. Shibuya, Tokyo, all the areas you'll visit. Uh, sorry about that. Getting all discombobulated here, sorry. Uh, there we go. That's a cool wanted poster right there. Some of the promotional artwork for the series that's been shown. Just really, I'm loving the vibe of this game. Just, you know, first one was all about... I mean, the first, or sorry, Persona 3. Uh, was the second game I played, I played uh, Persona 4 first. So, seeing 3 going from, like, it being really dark to, you know, number 4, which was all about, you know, murder investigations, and now it's being a thief, it's pretty cool. Um, very swell artwork. Oh man, you actually have some commentary here. Uh, that's really great. Uh, truth be told, this entire book, really, for me, is what was worth it. Oh, that's awesome. Can't wait to actually sit down and look at that a little bit more. Um, but, uh, yeah, it's looking like that's everything in there. Got, let's just put it all together one last time. Ooh. But, uh, definitely worth the 90 bucks. Uh, if you can hunt one down, uh, good luck. I'd highly recommend it. Uh, might be a little hard right now, but the value's there. Can't wait to sit down and play this game now. I hope you all enjoyed this. Sorry if it's a little rough. Uh, first time doing anything like that. Um, but please go out, get Persona 5, enjoy the game, uh, support it, and uh, thanks for watching.